Hi Vlogtober, welcome today. Six? Why is it so hard for me to remember the days? So right now we're going to the dog park. I have Parker with me and then I just have to go to the bank and like deposit a check. But that's what we're doing. <laughs> Okay, I'm back home. I'm gonna get ready to go. Um, I just need to run a couple errands. I need to go to Sephora to get some makeup for the wedding. Um, I need to go to Michael's and I need to go to Target. So I'll, yeah, I'm gonna take a shower and get ready and go do that stuff. Oh. My face is so red. Okay, just a shower. I don't think I'm gonna put any makeup on because I wanna get new foundation at Sephora. And I don't like when they try it on me, I swear, whenever. I love the people there, they're so helpful. But whenever I have them color match me in the store, I'm like, okay, yeah, and I just like listen to them. I'm such a pushover. And then I get home and I like do it myself and I'm like, oh my God, this is so dark. But yeah, it's like all the time too dark, never like too light. So I'm just gonna be like, no thanks. And I'm just gonna do it myself. But yeah, so I don't think I'm gonna wear any foundation. Hopefully my skin like calms down. It always gets really red after the shower and after I like rub um, lotion on it. I'll show you what I'm wearing. I'm wearing that gray sweatshirt again because I just love it. Oh, look at Park. Um, and then I'm wearing some Genie Baby shorts. I just made these the other day. Um, they're Levi's, right? Yeah, they're Levi's. And I always do cutoffs and so I wanted to do some rolled ones. I think it's like super 90s. This would be cute with like a big belt. I don't have like any belts but yeah and then I don't know what shoes I'm gonna wear probably something just really comfy I'm not gonna do any makeup like I said and then my hair I'm just gonna let it like air dry I don't feel like curling it or blow drying it I hate doing that let's go hi vlogtober I'm back from all my errands and I was gonna show you what I got so I went to Sephora michael's and target i'm not gonna show you what i what i got from michael's because it's for maddie's wedding and it's um just like wood and um paint markers it's for me to make a sign maybe i'll show you the sign after i make it so let's start with target i got this lip liner i was gonna get one at sephora but they're all just so expensive and i feel like lip liner for me is just super basic like i just want one that's um like the color of my lips i feel like i don't know i'm not picky about it so i got it it's from um the brand pixie and it's in the color soft nude hold on parker wants to, me to let her out okay so yeah i got a lip liner i also got these real techniques um like beauty sponges because you get two for ten and I've heard they're really comparable to the Beauty Blenders. And the Beauty Blender, just one is 20. So yeah, I wanted to try these. I've heard they're really good. And then I got this Witch Hazel Toner in Lavender. It's by Thayer's. Thayer's? I feel like in between seasons, my skin just gets like a little bit more oily and like kind of confused. So I just feel like it needs a little bit more love. So I want to put this toner on before I put my moisturizer on. And I've used this before and I really like it. And then last thing from Target, I got these rings. They're really pretty, like super sparkly. I got them for the wedding. I wanna like stack them. I think two on one finger and then one on another finger. I just want um, my hands to be like all blinged out. What, Parky? Okay, now I'm gonna do what I got from Sephora. So the first thing is the Born This Way foundation and I'm in the color Snow. So I've watched YouTube forever and I feel like every like beauty makeup person has talked about this. And so I really wanted to try it and I heard it's super good for um, like pho taking photos. And I know the Makeup Forever HD is really good. Maddie, the girl getting married, my friend uses that. And I've used it like, a little bit before and she really likes it. 
but I don't know. I just wanted to try this one, and I feel like if this one fails, then I'll go to the other one because I put them both like on my hand and on my skin and I just like love the way this one felt like on my skin like immediately the makeup forever I think is a little bit more liquidy and I don't know because I have like oily combination skin I just liked the texture of this better I did have them help me I, I know I said before like I hate when they color match me I got two shades that I thought I was I got snow and then what was the other one called oh I forget but I did snow on this side of my face and then the other one on this side and it was like one shade different and I walked around the store forever just like looking at stuff like waiting for it to like set in a little bit and then I went to the mirror like closest to the windows and I looked and the a little bit darker one totally oxidized and like was orange around the edges and I hate that it like scares me so bad so I went with the lighter shade and it's gonna be fall and winter and I get super pale and you can always I'm like not scared of too light foundations because I mean if it's crazy light but I feel like you can always blend bronzer around your face and like it'll work out. Um, so that's the first thing I got and then I got a new blush. Um, I've tried this before but it's Orgasm from NARS. It's like the classic blush. Um, I want to open it and look at it. So this was $30. This foundation was $39. I want to tell you guys how much this stuff is. So yeah, the foundation was 39. The orgasm blush was 30. And it's like a lot of blush. Like it's a huge pan of blush. So I'm not mad about that. And then the next thing I got was the Anastasia Brow Wiz. I've repurchased this like a thousand times. One thing I hate about it is that it like you go through it so fast. It's like a whole pencil, but I swear there's only like this much product in it. It, that and that annoys me but in the color taupe when I dyed my hair super dark um, I went up to medium brown but now my hair is really light so taupe just matches my brows and kind of lightens them a little bit but yeah taupe is my color then the next thing I got is the Laura Mercier translucent powder I use this to set and like bake my under eyes and then I put a little bit all over my face and it's super good at keeping you just matte yeah, like my oily spots like this like can't it like the oil can't break through this product I have been using the Glossier Wowder and I really like it but there is like a pigment to it and there's no pigment to this it's obviously translucent and you can like pack it on and it'll make you super matte, but you can't see like a color. The Wowder, if I get too much like um, in my brows or like down by my um, jaw, you can like see the powder and it like, I don't know. I really like the Wowder, but I repurchased this because for the wedding, I just feel like it's a safer bet and I know that I love it. And this was, oh, the Brow Wiz is $21, which is really annoying because yeah, I feel like it honestly only lasts me maybe two months so i feel like that sucks you have to repurchase it so much and then um this translucent powder was 38 but this lasts forever like literally i want to say almost a year my old one i had it for so long because you don't use a ton and it's fully here i'll open it and show you it's like a huge container like full of powder and yeah I barely use any and then the last thing I got was the last thing yeah um I got professional primer I like to just put this right here like on my cheeks because I feel like your pores are really big there and it mattifies really well I can't put it all over my face because it like mattifies too much and will make like some spots my foundation like stick to some spots so i'm like pretty careful where i put this but i love it and then i did get a free gift which is another primer that i've never tried but i've heard a lot about and it's the smashbox photo finish so i think i'm doing my own face makeup for the wedding so i think i'm gonna practice and I'm gonna use, I'm gonna practice like two times. Today is Saturday, the wedding is on Friday, so I have um, almost a week. So I'm gonna practice two times and try using this and then the other one and see what I like better. So I think that's it. Yeah, that's um, all the stuff I got. So now I'm gonna eat lunch, I'm super hungry. Stop, I spray her with a spray bottle if she barks. I'm gonna eat leftover Chinese food. So I'm gonna do that right now. I'm so hungry. Hi Vlogtober, I just got finished um, filming this makeup look. 
just for like a normal video. Um, it was super fun, but I have a huge like mess now and I just have to clean up, I'll show you. So this is like the aftermath. I just put all my makeup on this chair. But yeah, I wanna clean that up and then I wanna change my sheets and like do a, a couple things like around the house. But yeah, that's what we're up to. I'll park. Hey Vlogtober. Let me take my glasses off. They're like reflecting. So I've just been hanging out and chilling really. I'm pretty tired. I feel like I did a lot earlier. But I'm about to watch the movie Orange County. It's on Amazon Prime. And I used to love, do you guys remember this movie? I used to love this movie when I was younger. So I'm excited to watch it. And then I'm just getting a dinner. I'm pretty hungry. It's about like 6.30, 6.30. So I'm just gonna eat and then watch this. And I think that's it. I just wanna have a super chill night. I might do a face mask. But yeah, so I might update you in a little bit, but if I don't, I'll see you tomorrow for another day of Vlogtober. Bye.